Welcome to videos guys, my name is indeed Kyle Guppert and today I'll be talking about honestly something that I never wanted to hear and never expected to hear. If you are around my age, like around 20, 19, around there, uh, you grew up with this little indie film called Shrek. It's got the memes, it's got funny jokes, it was it was kind of got some adult humor in there that went over your head, but as you grew older and you watch it again, you're like, wow, that was fucking dark and humorous, but I love it. They're rebooting it. I'M RECORDING! What? I'm an American, who votes anymore? Getting back to it, the rebooting Shrek. It's kind of tough, isn't it? And it's not just like DreamWorks is remaking it or anything like that. The new animation overlords apparently are remaking it. And it's the guy who did Despicable Me. I'm sick and tired of that studio doing these big animation things. First off, don't reboot Shrek. Don't even do it. Like, there's one of those things where like, don't do it unless the uh, graphics are going to be improved on. And honestly, yeah, the w the first one, even though a lot of people shit on, I don't have a problem with it. But people like, it, do it doesn't look as good as it would in like nowadays. I'm like, you have a fair, obviously, but like, I think it looked fine. And then the f I think the fourth one, like, was made in, like somewhere like 2011, so somewhere around there. So it's not like the franchise is super effing old. It's from the same studios, Illumination Studios, I think. If, if you get the guy who's behind uh, Despicable Me, I can't imagine it being DreamWorks doing it. I fucking despise their animation style. I don't think there's a lot of soul and life behind their animation. And... I mean, there's some over-the-top things they do, but that's it. They're like, they're good at animating over-the-top body language. That's all they're really good for. Everything else, it's like nothing that much. Because see, the thing is with Shrek, he's not over-the-top with body language. It's very natural. But his facial expressions are a little bit more over-the-top. And his humor is a little bit more grown-up, if this, to say the least. And I don't see Illumination Studios doing that. And... I, this guy who's, uh, I can't remember his last name, is like Mendel Derry or some bullshit like that. He said, we're taking this very seriously, so it's kind of difficult finding a story that will please the fans of the original. I mean, how about this? Don't do it, dipshit. What are your thoughts down below, guys? Just comment. I want to hear your thoughts. Are you an OG fan of Shrek? I remember watching the first Shrek movie, guys. I remember watching on cassette tape. What are these kids saying? Well, that's a cassette tape. Exactly. I was Twitter, Instagram, comes underscore videos. Go follow me there for the latest news and updates on my channel, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and all that crap. Later. Goodbye.